first thing to do is the we need to install Thermox. This is a terminal emulator and a Linux environment. Since we since I don't have a computer or a laptop, so I need to install a Node.js and npm. So we're going to use Thermox for that. We're going to open. So here is the terminal. And now we're going to install the root repository. PKG install root repo. So by installing it will take time and also uh, and also we need to have a we need to have enough space for in our internal storage for this installation. After that is the PKG update. And the PKG update takes a lot of time because there are things that we need to consider. Like for example, we have eight choices in which I only type Y. Here at this part. Now it's time to install the Node.js. So, PKG install Node.js that dash LTS. So the LTS is we're going to use because we need a long term use. So we're going to continue by typing Y. So it says that 105 MB of additional disk space will be used. So here is it will be indicated. So if we're going to say no, then it won't be it won't be included in our internal storage. Just like the other, just like other process, when it comes to installing, it really does take a lot of time. So we need, so we need patient, for, patience for that. So we're going to unpacking the Node.js LTS. Now here we're going to see if it is completely installed. So we're going to type node-v. It's to know the version of our node. So we can see that the ver says our node is version 12.18.13.
we're going to check the version of our NPM or the Node Package Manager. So in 6.14, 6.6, .6, 